Viral video, it's all part of a mystery centered around Sedona, Arizona. This is a YouTube video posted by someone calling himself Funky Fathead. You can see a much more stable fracture. He says he's using a computerized tone generator to open a vortex, a portal in time and space. I haven't a clue where he is. He sounds American, so I'm hazarding a guess somewhere in the States. The video caught the attention of this man who posts videos from his home in England. He calls himself Hidden Underbelly. He went on to experiment with portals and um, sound frequencies. Hidden Underbelly spoke to us via Facebook messaging after this video racked up more than a million views. That in itself is after he was unable to reach Funky Fathead, the video made news in the Daily Star, headlined, Bloke Missing After Opening Portal of Time and Space in His Bedroom. You see, Funky Fathead hasn't been seen or heard from in four months. He did leave one clue, however. If you don't know where that is, I do. Is it Sedona? Sedona is known for having um, on one, one of the great portal sites about it is that people try to go find these um, portals. But is there enough energy here for Funky Fathead to poke a hole into the known universe and travel there through a portal? Yes, that's what Vortex Energy can do, gateways doorways, openings, portals. We didn't see Funky Fathead here, so we guess he's still missing. We even asked our editor, Kelly Laws, to see if he could make a similar photo, and here's what he came up with. So we reached out to Funky Fathead via YouTube for comment on his wildly successful video. We've not heard from him yet. Funky Fathead is a YouTuber that was experimenting with portals by using frequencies. Now, this clip that I'm going to show you is from his channel, and this is his first experiment where he was using 432 hertz frequencies to open up a portal. There's the fracture. Other videos that show this thing opening up. I'll go into it later. You saw in the last clip, he was working on the frequencies at 528 hertz, and he was getting a fracture in space and time. So what he decided to do was to get the fracture open at 528, and then quickly reduce it to 5. 25 hertz and this led to an opening to a place called Sedona now here's this clip fluctuation there there we go
you don't know where that is, I do. It is in Sedona. And it is a well-known uh, vortex um, phenomenon. Uh, there's several of them there. And you are witnessing a, uh, a gate, portal, wormhole, Stargate, whatever you want to call it, from this bedroom to another state. Using a mixture of two solid tones. And now it's four months later since he's opened that portal and not a peep from him. I have written to him several times and heard nothing back. And to me, something's bizarre because if I was experimenting with something like this, I know that if I didn't, didn't have my family, I would be tempted to stick my hand through, stick my arm through, stick my leg through, and then stick my whole body through. And I'm wondering if Funky Fathead did that. So wherever you are, brother, 